Finland. With a population of 5.5 million, this beautiful but remote Scandinavian country is the most sparsely populated nation in the European Union. Known for their so-called sisu, meaning strength of character, determination and willpower, the Finns have been some of the world's very best throwers, particularly in the javelin, where they've earned seven Olympic men's titles, including a clean sweep of the medals in 1920 and 1932. Currently sitting at the forefront of this proud tradition of Finnish javelin throwers is 30-year-old Antti Ruskinen, the 2012 Olympic bronze medalist and current European champion. His medal from Zurich is a historic one, as it's Finland's first gold from a European Championships in 40 years. I'm, I'm very pr proud about that because I'm not ne never thinking about it's 40 years. It's it's a long time, but we have good results from World Championships and Olympics, but not in European Championships. It's nice to do some history. Yeah, I'm very proud. He did a lot of work, and uh, that was a prize and uh, I'm very happy. Uh, it's a lot of hard work and uh, a lot of uh, hours and days and weeks. And uh, that's the result for us. <laughs> At the age of four, Ruskinen sat glued in front of the television watching intently as his hero, Tapio Kourios, won the Olympic gold medal at the 1988 Seoul Olympics. Enthralled by the javelin, he soon started practicing himself. I get uh, my first coach when I was nine years old. So he told me and teach me how do you draw javelin. What you, it's important to learn technique for every sport. And he also teach me another sport, but also in javelin. I have very, very, very good things that I can get nine years old. The professional coach who told me how do you draw the javelin. So. I think that is the reason in Finland why we have also good drawers. Ruskinen fulfilled his childhood dream of becoming an Olympic medalist in London 2012, an experience he describes as unforgettable. It was amazing. There was 80,000 people and I was like, whoa, I think that's what it's my and will be the best place to draw and what athlete can get. The javelin draw final was same time than Mo Farah won uh, 5,000 meters and uh, the people are yelling so much I, so I have to put my fingers to the ears and it was amazing so that was a good experience. I was in third and I throw 84 and 12 I think and I lost the Olympic gold medal 47 centimeters so it was quite close but it was good for my career and good for my continue my Javelin throw career, and I knew it now. And I have every chance to want also another big competition. So that was amazing competition and good for good thing for me. Ruskinen's dreams have gotten bigger as he's grown older. Being an Olympian is not enough anymore. The goal now is to win Finland's first Olympic gold medal since his childhood hero Tapio Kourios in '88. Won the Olympic gold medal. That's my first goal my whole career. I think it's young boy, someday I won the Olympic gold medal. In London it was quite close, 47 centimeters. And my second dream is to throw, throw the javelin over 90 meters. My coach Aki Parvian says, then you are javelin throwers when you throw over the 90 meters. <laughs> so I hope I can throw someday over 90 meters.